popping what's what's happening it's me your girl gracie minor and i'm back again with a very interesting vlog kamakawa ide and today i'm super 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 excited because why i want a safari you guys i want a safari and we're going to guess where okay Samuru. I don't know how many of you have been to Samburu, but I know I've not been to Samburu, so this was an opportunity of a lifetime and I thought to myself, why not? And we are traveling, we started off um, the journey at 6 a.m. in the morning, yeah, and we are at, we just passed Sagana, we are heading off to Samburu. Sijuko ni Samburu iko, but I know it's along this side, so that's what we're going to do and we're going to enjoy this day and I'm going to keep you posted because, you know, I got you, I got you. So, hey, let me tell you guys, another track plan. I've never seen this track. I've never been in this track. So this is an experience on its own. This is what we're using. This is what we're using. Super, super nice. Let me tell you about the track. Kidogo. Kidogo. So the track, <laughs> I feel shy. People are looking at me. But the track is, is, is when you can go on Danny, it's nice. But when you start moving, you feel like you're very high. And so, because you're high, the center of gravity is very. You can barely, you know, I get. So, when you swerve, you feel like, not like when you swerve, like when you're like changing lane, stuff like that. <laughs> when you're changing lane and stuff like that, you feel like um, it's like a big swerve. Like, you feel like a man, a sana, out. Like, it's not like your kawaida gari ama lori you get but it's super interesting and i'm gonna keep you posted we are here for a bathroom break and we are continuing on with our journey so i'm gonna keep you posted bye guys bye and hey guys this track was so amazing and super super comfortable on the inside oh and did i mention we had a very smooth drive to samburu <music> Nanyuki, we're in Nanyuki, and in Nanyuki, that's where the um, latitude, there are three latitudes, I think. And the only one I think I know for now is the equator, and the equator passes right here through the Nanyuki town as you're heading over to Samburu. And there's a place that you can take photos and make memories. And also, if you guys so there's this streak eh, that happens here at um, Nanyuki, at, at the equator, of course. Um, when you are at that other side of the equator, I think the, the, what is it called? Like, I don't know how to explain it, but if you're on the other side of the equator um, and you put a stick, like a small kakijuti kadogo on water, the kakijuti rotates clockwise or anti-clockwise and when you move over to the other side the 
Kakijiti rotates the other opposite, opposite side. If it was rotating clockwise, when you come to this other side, it's going to rotate anti-clockwise. If it is rotating anti-clockwise, if you come to this other side, it's going to rotate clockwise. Yeah, 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 that's the whole idea about the equator here at Nanyuki. Yo, yo. So we are still on transit. We've come here to take a few photos and um, take a small bathroom break as well as photos and yeah safari komzuri we are happy and we are exploring <laughs> anyway that's to say that it's indeed a very nice trip and i'm gonna plug you guys um to this um tour company yes i'm gonna plug you on the next stopover Cindy, i'll tell you which tour company has made this all possible for me and my friends and the rates and for other i'm gonna plug you in on other um, what is it called other trips yes i think the next one that the samburu trip the next one that is happening is gonna happen in september i think so i'm not really sure but i'm gonna keep you posted and make sure you follow me on my instagram pages that's where i'm gonna be posting all the information about this tour company that has made this happen i'm super super excited i'm so glad to be here Lovely photographer. I'm just gonna wave right now. Yes. <laughs> Did the work. So, ukiona na sleep alu juni kata si Angela. I'm in pigama picture, and now we are off on to the next one. Sawa sawa. I'll keep you posted, guys. Mabla. Everything good. Everything good. Good life. Good health. Date. We are finally at the Buffalo Springs National Preserve here in Samburu and the heat is crazy. We're about to leave and this is the entry to the place that we are going. I uh, was a bit... Uh, I slept in the car so that's why I didn't come out here earlier but this is the place we are going to. Um, I guess I'm gonna see you inside. Yes, let's go. Hi guys, we are finally inside the Buffalo Springs National Reserve. Let it there is a lot of heat so we are here um we are we just want to have a good time we have come here to swim at the buffalo springs and you guys this is where we're gonna swim show them is this water clean but in a kapoa For those who cannot see it, the water is blueish, blueish, and it's not dirty by the way, it's clean, just that it's somewhere that is not really. It's not a typical swimming pool, by the way, guys. It's not, but it's blue. So we're gonna work with that. <laughs> Anyways, Chanchungi Suyangu Singe and Dani. Angela is over there, she really wants to get in. <laughs> Because it's too hot, it's too hot. I'm afraid of getting in and um, coming out a laughing party sunburn, but who cares? We're here for that. 
we are here for everything also guys we are in the middle of a national park i don't know the difference between a game a game reserve and a national park Sidri. but all i know is that we've been told Kuneza, there are lions like the lions roaming and so we need to be close to the track over there and that's the reason why we have not parked too far from the spring um because we need to be alert and 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 on the lookout for such animals like lions because i can see zebras over there yeah i don't know if you guys can see it there are zebras over there there's some other animals on that side i know sijikama and lizo antelopes we've seen some giraffes as we were coming here but anyway guys i think i'm gonna change into my swimming costume and dive in it's not too deep so we don't i don't need a floater <laughs> And those people who know how to swim when they can touch the ground. If I cannot touch the the ukochini, yeah. I can't swim, you guys. I'm gonna drown. So let's do this. <laughs> See you on the next one, guys. right behind me that is Samburu for you guys and for me as well we we, were, we are done swimming we came from Buffalo Springs um, to swim we swam there for like an hour or 30 minutes or so then from there we came to a very small town here just as you proceed as you proceed as you're proceeding on to Moyale Marsabit road there's a small town just after the buffalo um, national reserve we've come here for a few um, necessities some people are grabbing some things some drinks and things like that others are eating yeah so that is um our evening from here we're gonna go over to to what to what to what to where the campsite is because because right now it is when they're setting the campsite so we can't go there we're gonna go there um, later on so right now it's just sundowner and then we hit the campsite later on we are here and we want to get a few things and um, I know I had promised you guys um, something to do with um, the trip adventure or the agency that has made all this possible uh which is it goes by the name tk adventures let what ones are picky picky peter <laughs> anyway as Iki peter make sure you subscribe to this channel yes and leave me a comment have you ever been to samburu have you ever been to buffalo springs comment section and please Take time and also subscribe to this channel because it's absolutely free and very, very, very supportive. Okay, so as I was saying, the travel agency that has made this possible um, is TK Adventures. TK Adventures. We that is we, me, my friend, and Angie. me and Angie. 
You guys, I'm not going Swahili too. Anyway, me and Angie do too. Lipa and I have a couple of other friends. Jamie, if you know her, she's been on this channel before. Um, to Lipa via TK Adventures, and uh, we are here and we're having a good time. Make sure you check them out um, on their social platform platforms. That is on Instagram and also Facebook. Um, TK Adventures. TK Adventures. Thank you so much for this trip. Um, so far so good so far so good i can't complain um though they had promised to photography professional photography that we have not experienced that we've not experienced but as earlier on earlier on when we were setting on off the journey there were there was a little bit of uh mix up kidogo kidogo and that's when that's why i guess uh imekuwa hard kwa kupanga such things sabu tulikuja na trucks to meachana and i think they didn't have enough um, photographers photographers so i tend to believe that is the reason why um photography or professional photography has not been offered but so far so good i like it i've enjoyed it i've seen new places i didn't think existed yes and um yeah it's nice i i i am okay i have had fun and we're looking i'm looking forward to a great night of fun and bonfire and things like that and just enjoying each other's company yeah and i'll keep you posted if my phone does not go off i hope it doesn't go off so i think i'm not gonna show a lot i'm just gonna try and uh, show you a few clips here, here and there so that i can be able to save up on um charge catch you on the next one Guys. Hello guys, we, or rather I, we have arrived at the location, at the tented camps, yes, they look like this, spread all over to that side, then on this other side, all the way to that other side, now we are tent hunting, we want to look for the best tent, we don't want to sleep in Jesana, we want to be in the middle of everyone <laughs> i guess that's safer <laughs> that's angie calling me over there no one better put tent hunting and a ringer and a summon to post with you twitter mm-hmm what to lala kwa twitter anyways <laughs> i'm super excited i think i'm gonna show you like a very like a photo or a video clip of the tent but for now let's let me get a tent first then I'm gonna come and update all of you. So you see why we want to sleep katikati. Ukoivo, there's nothing, like literally there's nothing on the edges of this. Checking. Akuna I say there are no people living there. It's just bare land. So I think being at the center is gonna be safer, yes? I you don't have to come with everything. Oh yeah, okay. Okay, we're also booking for some of our friends who are not yet here. They came with another truck and they wakachele wakidogo. So we're gonna book for them, then us, and then like that. So let me show you the toilets first of all before the light ipote. These are the toilets, guys. I think there's water, so it's that's nice, that's nice. There's water. It's for the this is the bathroom. Let me show you. Let me flip over the camera. This is the bathroom over there. And this is the toilet. Right over there. Yeah. And there's water supply over there. So that's, what I, that's where guy get yango. That's where we're going to take bathroom breaks. And also shower, I think, tomorrow. If we have the energy and the wheel power to shower okay let's look for a tent first okay see you when you get one guys the tents are supposed to hold two people two people per tent but since our friends are also coming to mefikiria we get let me turn this side because it's like this side we get two big ones so that we can sleep three three yes we're all ladies don't worry don't worry <laughs> we're all ladies we're gonna we're gonna take two huge tents then we're gonna sleep three, three of us, three in each. Yes, I'm gonna show you how big they look inside. Because I got you, because I got you, because I got you. 
It's booked, you guys. Two tents, three each. Yaza, bye. You guys, I think what I'm gonna do is just go, I'm gonna log out and I'm gonna talk to you guys tomorrow. I think I'm gonna show you the inside of the tent tomorrow and how this campsite looks tomorrow because there's no light and I don't wanna keep, um, I wanna save charge for tomorrow. So I think we're gonna talk tomorrow. So, you guys, be safe and catch you tomorrow. Bye. Day two. Samburu National Reserve. We are here at. We are back. We are back at Buffalo Springs. This is day two, you guys. Jana Simulizima. But quick update on yesterday's events. We had a bonfire. We danced. Hyped all night. Danced to reggae. Some more reggae. Some readings. And some raga. <laughs> anyway, we are back here for just swimming kidogo kidogo. Then we head out and then go for brunch, I guess, and then go back home. Remember, all those that have made this possible is Tiki Adventures. Yes, Tiki Adventures. Check them out on their Facebook and Instagram social platform. So, we are going to do and she was high on sugar. Imagine. Sugar rush kabisa. Anyway, we have some few minutes and I just want to swim haraka raka because the water is like natural heated pool. Me, but they miss when you swim, but. Maybe you could swim. Anyway, I'll tell you some game up. Catch you in the next one. Bye. We are here at the Samburu National 
Faisal over there. So this place, I was in about it when I was in primary school. It's like the National Reserves in Kenya, Samuru National Reserve, and it's so nice to be actually to be here, like in flesh and blood, <laughs> and to see this place. Um, just taking a few photos right outside there. We're gonna, I think we're gonna just leave right now for brunch. I think we're gonna have brunch. I'm not sure, but if we do, I'm gonna show you that. But now just photos and people catching up right over there. That is our track. That is the crew, the gang gang, the illest, the latest crew. <laughs> anyway, guys, I think I'm gonna catch you on later. Um, on during the day, people are making noise. I'm a piano vibe. I'm a piano vibes. Right over there. <laughs> anyway, I think I'm gonna catch you guys later on. Yeah, when you're going, when you're having brunch. So. bunch of people but lunch is up we have some chicken as long as it's chicken by the way the rest can can find it way down to the stomach <laughs> anyway um i think i'm gonna end this vlog here um maybe we'll show a few clips after this but i think i'm gonna end it here uh, please subscribe to this channel if you have not and kindly leave me a comment let me know um, if you've ever been to Samburu. And what was your experience? Because the heat here is crazy. Anyway, that is it from me, guys. See you next time on the next one.